Hi, I'm Paul Scholl with Mettler Toledo, and I'd like to take you through the use of the EasyMax 102 with the React AR45M. The combination of these two instruments really creates the perfect workstation for process development, with the EasyMax allowing you to safely and reproducibly control all of your reaction variables, and the React IR measuring any changes in the concentrations of key reactive species, which may be a result of those changes in those key reaction variables, automatically as a function of time without having to remove any samples for analysis. So we accomplish this through the use of this device, which is a multiplexer. You see that there are two fiber optic conduits coming out of this multiplexer, leading to these probes that are going into the vessels. The vessels I have here, one has a Teflon cover on it. These probes are designed specifically for the EasyMax. They're, they're very uh, thin in diameter. They're 6.35 millimeter a quarter inch. And you can see that there's an adapter here with the probe through the Teflon cover. And there's another adapter here, which is a glass adapter, which is going into a glass cover. The software uh, operates very simply in that you essentially give the commands to each one of these probes to collect a spectra as a function of time. So you just define the time interval between the spectra and how long you want to carry out the reaction, and the software takes over uh, collecting that data automatically. The experiments actually can be parallel experiments, so where essentially you're running the same chemistry with maybe some slight variation in some parameters, or they can actually be two completely independent experiments. In fact, you can have two chemists sharing one instrument with, for example, two reactions going on side by side on either side of the react IR with each probe in each reaction vessel studying those reactions uh, simultaneously or sequentially. Uh, the software is designed on the same platform. It's both software packages, the eye control software for EasyMax and ICIR for react IR are designed on the same platform, and they are completely interoperable. Now, what I mean by that is that the data can be seamlessly shared between the two software packages. So you can take any trend from React IR and display that in eye control, or you can take any eye control parameter, such as steering uh, or heat flow, and display that within ICIR software. In fact, you can take it one step further and you can actually control some actions, some unit operations of the EasyMax based on the data from the React IR, which could be something as simple as a relative concentration trend. It could be the results from a quantitative analysis that's ongoing in real time. Or it could be some mathematical results from some math function that you're performing based on the infrared data.